Hi, I'm Supreet from Drupal Doc. Today, let's look at how to create a responsive tab layout using the Quick Tab module in Drupal. I've gone ahead and installed the modules. We need to enable Quick Tabs and the Quick Tab styles. Once that is done, let's head over to Structures and Quick Tabs. Here, click on the Styles tab at the top. So, as you can see here, these are the style options that a quick tab module provides. For making it responsive, I've seen that the max style works best. Let's go back to list quick tabs. Click on add quick tabs instance. Give a sample name. In renderer, we have other options as well. You can go ahead and explore them. For today, we're going to use Quick Tabs. Style, let us select Mac as we discussed. Default tab will not be available unless a tab is created. And about the Ajax options, as long as you have a light view, it should be fine. No should be fine. If you have a heavy one, make sure that you select Yes so that there won't be a lot of delay in rendering of the Quick Tab. Now, for the tab title let's give tab 1 and these are the tab type options it can one can place a block in the tab or a view or a particular node or other options so for for this one let us select node and we need to specify the node ID here of, of, of the content that we want to place so for that let us move to find content If you hover on any of the nodes, you should be able to see the URL at the uh, right above the window start button, which is having the node ID which says 14. Or in case the path auto module is used, we need to go for the hover on the edit link to get the node ID. So 14 is the node ID. Let me go back, place 14, and then view mode again. This all these ca can be configured. There are options to delete a tab or add a tab. So any number of tabs can be added here. I have already created a quick tab sample. Let me show that to you. Quick tabs Mac and tab 1 is available now. So I have created five tabs with one having a long name. Once a tab layout is created, click on Save and then go to Structures and Blocks. Here, Quick Tab has to be assigned a region. Let me assign main content for this one. And save Blocks. I'm going to open the site in a different browser and we have the Quick Tab coming up. Let me show it to you that it is responsive. And the theme I've used here is the responsive uh, picture reloaded theme, which is a responsive theme by provided by Adaptive Themes. So with a little bit of styling, it can, it can be made to look much better. I have some CSS styling done for this. which I will be sharing in the description below. So with the styling it should look like this. Of course it can be more made much more better. Okay. Hope you like the tutorial. Uh, if you have any doubts please leave a comment below. Do hit the like button and subscribe for our upcoming videos.